Well, I'm delighted to welcome the Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, I think just, you know, in, in general, all the names on there, every, every player that's been at the top of their game has, has won this championship. So, um, yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty cool to be on there. It's, it, it really hasn't sunk in yet. I, I don't think it will for a few weeks. Um, but, yeah, it's, it's just unreal. Yeah, I, I think to, to win an Open Championship uh, in itself is probably going to be a golfer's highlight um, in their career. Um, to do it around St Andrews, I think, is just unbelievable. Um, this place is so cool. Um, I love the golf course, I love the town, and um, yeah, hopefully we can keep that, that trend going with the uh, every 50 years, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Uh, I sometimes think that uh, being behind on certain golf courses and in, in certain situations is, is maybe a good thing. I, th I think um, it's very easy to get defensive out there and, and, and keep you know, hitting it to 60, 70 feet and you can make pars all day, but you, you're not going to make birdies. And um, yeah, I, I think it was a good thing that I was definitely behind. I think my mindset would have been a touch different coming in, especially on that back nine if, if I was ahead. Um, I think my shot into, uh, my second shot into 13 uh, was really when I thought that, um, yeah, we can, we can win this thing. My dad was actually meant to come over, um, and he pulled out in on the in the last minute. Basically, um, I had a chat with a quick chat with him before. He's kicking himself now. Um, uh, yeah, but why, why didn't he come? Sorry, your dad. Why, why wasn't he able to? It was just just it was just just kind of the thought of doing all that travel for for one week, <laughs> <laughs> basically. I'm gonna guess two. Two cans of beer. How many more will you have after that? Uh, I'll probably have about 20 claret jugs. <laughs> <laughs> well done, mate.